Why am I here today? Well, you know, someone I work with told me recently that 300,000 people a year are already dying from the effects of climate change right now. And I was really, really shocked by that figure. Um, you know, this is what's happening now. What's going to be happening, you know, in the future when climate change really takes hold? I've tried writing letters, I've signed petitions, I've been on marches, um, but I know that in this time frame that's not always enough. And I think at this kind of crucial moment, um, this is the right time for direct action. I've not taken action in this way before. Um, I've been on a lot of marches. Um... I mean, we're in an emergency situation. And we all know what the scientists are telling us, but yet the politicians just aren't putting in the policies that we need. Um, and I care about the future. I care about what might happen to my children if I'm happy to have children. And I can't let things slide, you know? I have to get up and do something. Um, do I feel nervous um, when I'm doing this kind of thing? Yeah, really, really nervous, you know, quite sick, really. I've never actually taken direct action to this scale before. Well, I feel nervous and I feel a little bit scared, um, but I feel proud to be doing something that I believe in and to be with other people who are standing up um, and um, saying what needs to be said. Uh, my message to our politicians is to sort us out at Copenhagen, go in there and make sure that our world leaders agree a good global deal on climate change because this is one of our last chances.